Hey everybody, I'm KK. I'm Kristen. Together we are K and K Crochet. Welcome back. This is um, a collaboration that Ella from No Catchy Name asked us to participate in and it's called Nostalgic Christmas 23 and this is I believe number seven for us and so we just wanted to stop by and show you some things we're making and talk about why and about some memories and some different things and we may be doing some other stuff as we go along the way. It's just right now um, we're recording these videos and who knows we may go farther into this in December um, just to share what's going on but this is not a pattern that is um, out there and I think I wrote the pattern down if somebody absolutely had to have it but I doubt anybody really wants the pattern but um, I don't remember where it's at I'll have to look for it so this is um, my version of with a uh, red heart white sparkle and if it's anything like the rest of the videos we did you're not going to be able to see it so I'm trying to get it to where you could see it mm. let's do this hold that oh okay okay let's see fitting the Ella bag yep and you're still not going to be able to see it real well I don't think so it's no I don't understand Here. why I can't get it to show um there yeah. we go. Okay, so it's an icicle, if you can't tell. It's flat on the top. It has the little ridges down the side here. And um, these are from, this is not a pattern, like I said, that was anywhere else. This is something that I grew up with. And they were, let me see if I can find the picture so I could show you. Yeah, I had two and now I can't find them. If you look here, really close around the doorway you can see the lights and you see they're sticking out around through there kind of like the astro pups we used to eat that's what they look like and we had those growing up and they were just these little icicles that you would um let me see if that will help that you would put on your tree and they had the little plastic sleeve on them and they just had the little um points hanging down on the top and so I wanted one to remind me of that and so that's what that is that's my little icicle that I made to put on the tree and um, yeah so let me see if I can find the other one that showed them I don't think that really helped probably Our not case I think it just there it is down. look on the door there you can see them hanging they had the little clear sleeve over the light so that made it look like an icicle Icicle, 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 however you say it, I always say it different than everybody else. So um, that's what I did for that. And then today's stitch, so that I can add on to my um, chain, is called the griddle stitch. And this is mainstay metallic silver. I think it's mainstay. And I have not added it on to my little chain yet. So we're just going to show you. See how it kind of looks like a almost like a puff stitch but it's not it's really cute I thought the griddle stitch and it was really super easy um, I'm trying to think what I did hold it it's alternating double crochet and single crochet where last time we did the Suzette stitch that had a single and a double in one stitch this is alternating a double and a single as you go across and it just makes this really pretty fabric I really like that. I like the griddle stitch. That's a new stitch that I'd like to use in something. So I don't have it put together yet because we're doing these one at a time and well, all at one time. And so I don't have it put together, but I will put it together like that when I'm done and sew in my ends. And that will be my next stitch. Do you have a memory? Yeah. Oh, you have a finished object. I do have an object. She she wanted to know could she participate? I said of course. So she this came to be the that, only one I do though. But she came the other night and she wanted to participate with a memory that she had. But before I'm gonna show you my ornament of the day, a little nutcracker because my brother loves nutcrackers. Um, so one memory that I particularly do not remember, but I see photos of a lot. Mama always had me in a red velvet dress around the holidays. Hold on a second. Well, Go ahead, talk right. about it. Um, so there's like four or five different pictures of different times. One was I, I was a newborn, one I was almost two. There, I, those are the two that stick out the most of me in my red velvet dress. So I found a little dress pattern, it's actually for a doll, but I just made it into an ornament. And then I have a picture to go with it. Here, I got it. That's me in my little red velvet dress. I was almost two years old. It looks like Santa Claus. 
Santa Claus is a little princess. There's several of them. So and that's, I, like, one of my favorite things ever when I get to look back at those photos. And it wasn't really a planned thing, I don't think, but it just ended up being that way. Um, my mama really liked red, so I don't know. She was a red fanatic. Yep, but as we're talking about little red dresses, and I was going through, I just happened to see that one. There's me in my little red dress. It may be a top, but I think it's a dress. Look at that face. Oh, my goodness. I was good at making faces. So, anyway. Favorite memory is we just did it again last night. We all get in the living room and we watch Home Alone. Mm -hmm. Yep. We watched Home Alone. We watched um, National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation. I was not awake for that. And we also watched something else. What else did we watch? I don't know. I fell asleep. I was out. I have never watched National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation all the way through. I'd seen bits and pieces. So we watched that. My husband and I finished watching that last night. I think they were asleep. But we also watched Home Alone. And I thought we watched something else, but maybe I'm wrong. Did we try and watch Home Alone too, and then we decided to lampoon on Christmas? Yep, that's what I it was. I think that's what it was. Yep. So anyway, that's how that went. And um, two, I'm going to show this one real quick because this will be like a, yeah, right now when we're recording, it's Veterans Day. So I'm going to show this Christmas photo. This is me and my Uncle Dewey, and he was an Army vet. So... In memory of our vets, we say thank you, and thank you for your service, and thank your families for their service. And that's all we have for today, so we want to say thank you for joining us. Please hit the thumbs up button and um, run some of those videos. We'd appreciate that, too. And we keep um, our hours keep going up and down, up and down, up and down, and that's because we passed the year-long date. So once you pass the year-long date on YouTube, you lose any hours past the 365 days. Each day you drop more hours, right? So you have to keep adding to them. So we're trying to keep our hours up and um, yep, and share us out and tell somebody to subscribe. To subscribe. We'd appreciate that. We will have an update sometime um, on Bumblebee's Mountain Outreach, a couple actually of what we've been doing and what has been sent in. Um, we are really busy right now in the stages of distributing, so that's why those have kind of slowed down a little bit. We're trying to move those things out of our home into the hands they need to get to so that they can be used, right? So don't forget to be kind because you know else's else's journey. And don't forget to go check out Ella on No Catchy Name because she's the one that came up with Nostalgic Christmas 23. And she's come up with some really great things and some things I've never heard of before. So really exciting. Go check her out. Bye. Bye.